All right, hello, welcome to some Singe gameplay in the top lane. Another commentary. Uh, we we are stacking up some nice content. But yeah, uh, this video I feel like talking about uh, mental booming or like tilting your enemy team or tilting the enemy team. Sorry. Um, so right here, immediately starting is uh, already a mental game. I'm already in this Nasus's head as I'm pretending to be a passive player. I'm letting him farm. I'm purposely not going for free trades. This leads him into a sense of security and he thinks that he can just push or farm for free and that's it, right? We're emoting together. Uh, it seems like we're sharing a little bit of a chuckle, right? But in fact, uh, I realized that my trundle is going to gank topside immediately, right? So. Uh, I'm making it so that Nasus feels secure and safe, whereas he actually isn't. Um, and this is this is just I know this is a little bit of BM. It's definitely rather BM, but you do what you got to do for LP. Yeah. So scare him a little bit. Get the flip off. Chomp. Beat him. Very, very free. Um, I sh definitely should have taken the tur turret shot for the trundle, but it works out. And uh, Nasus is tilted. Right? He's here again. He TPs. He does a Hashinshin uh, play. And it kind of turns out badly because trundle got, got a little bit slow there. Um, I flash instantly. Gotta get out. You know, waste a little bit of time, it's fine. Yeah, um... What was I gonna say? This is this is about, um... So normally, uh, when, I, when I talk about uh, tilt, like especially tilting the enemy team, it's usually not a Nasus, because Nasus just farms, and that, that's usually true. Nasus, um... There's a Donghuap video that I refer to uh, basically like every other month whatever I talk about Nasus, is that Nasus really, really needs his team to function. Um, this is the opposite. We're focusing Nasus like crazy to tilt him to tilt the enemy team. Now, it sounds a little weird, uh, because it's like, what? How could that, right? But there's chat, you know? There's a thing called chat. And it, it's, uh, <laughs> people do not stop typing. I, I saw Nasus start typing, right, after after the first kill, and I was like, oh, he's one of those players. Uh, it's very, very clear that he will not stop. They will not stay silent, and they will keep typing, uh, even if everyone has muted them, because they're very, uh, I don't know, not insecure. I, I don't know what the word is. Uh, they're, they're very vocal uh, about their their problems so they'll complain about camping in all chat and then proceed to get camped more um, I don't know why you would type your PhD thesis on why ganking NASA's is a bad idea in all chat but he proceeds to do so and uh, <laughs> we just choose to bully the NASA's because from what we know so far for this game is that Trinomir is strange. Our, our Trinomir is not very good of a player. Um, so we're like, mm, probably, probably not have Trundle uh, gank uh, Trinomir. And then bot lane is kind of just like, okay, they'll scale. All right. But yeah, we're bullying this now since this guy has died basically every two minutes. Um, this guy jumps over the wall, I believe. Yeah. Trundle tries to go for a pillar cancel, but given he's on 200 ping, uh, it doesn't work out. Yeah. Um, I buy Dark Seal because I think it's funny. Um, <laughs> I just think it's funny. I don't know. Sometimes people people will start coming top more when they see certain items, and Dark Seal is like a taunt item. If the people are seeing, especially the enemy team, if the enemy team sees that I'm fully stacked on Dark Seal against the Nasus, 
fail flame the Nasus or get tilted because of the Nasus. Uh, Nasus's ability, uh, inability to handle uh, being just warding in general, right? So it's like it, it's like a double blow of having stacking AP from from the passive and affecting the mental uh, stability or mental fortitude of the enemy team. Here I just activate Predator whenever. Um, I'm not actually trying to fight this Nasus uh, too crazy, you know. We do gotta play it slow. Um, we don't want to fight him uh, when he is ult up, because it's going to be uh, a rough time. Because his Q comes up every like what, like two, three seconds. He can Q like Q auto auto Q or something. Um, but here I'm just like biding time to be annoying, right? Give Trundle the kill. And Trundle, I, I was flipping for Trundle, I wasn't trying to... Ah, god damn. <laughs> I have no mana, I back off. He also has no mana, so we both back off, it's fine. He gets to go for blue or something. But yeah, Nasus, 1 and 4, continuing the pattern of dying every 2 minutes. And th this is just like a... This is cyberbullying. Or essentially cyberbullying. That's like the purpose of spam ganking this Nasus, because we know this Nasus is not good. Um, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if I looked him up or something, but they don't really play Nasus. I think they're auto-filled. So if we if we if we spam gank the auto-filled player, the auto-filled player generally, uh, following the pattern, um, the trend or whatever, uh, they start typing a lot and that's what's happening um Nasus is literally already dead um so and then he he's spam pinging he's complaining in all chat he does not stop typing and it's great it's a good time um and th this, is, this is i don't know <laughs> this is the strat because our, our trinomir was being weird so we were like mm, probably Probably not, you know. Eventually bot lane will scale, hopefully. Hopefully. Um for a good amount for a good a chunk of time uh for this game. This game seemed really, really good only for top lane. Um really sad. <laughs> Unfortunato. Go for a rough dive. Um, let me just chill, you know. Let me just chill. Don't don't get, don't gotta go too crazy. Get Nasus cocky again, right? And then just like stand around. Nasus hits that ghost. Hits the Nas. Ghosts away, he blows ghost, and we can just push this. Sadly, this is really unfortunate. The animation for Trundle Q is slower than Kha'Zix Q, so you both die. Uh, we do kill their Echo though, who has a, uh, you see this? Anyone else see this? He's a Bramble Vest. Like, obviously, like, it makes sense in a way that's like, oh yeah, damage, but, you know, like turning off the healing, but still, it's like, what? I oh, don't know, anyways. <laughs> we are bullying the Nasus. Now his, uh, deaths per minute has gone lower. Here I go over the shutdown on Velkaz because Velkaz is 4 kills instead of going for MF who's 0-0. Zero, zero. Or the Echo who died previously. I'd rather go for the shutdown and give that to Vayne. Getting that to Vayne is really really big because then she can start, start just kind of snowballing in gold. Um, at least that's how my thought process was. And then they immediately die again. 
I'm just like, okay, well, my bot lane is 2 and 5. Not a good luck. Not amazing. I wish uh, some players were more consistent, but then again, this is ha this happens in basically every single rank, no matter where you go. Um, there are people who play tilt. There are people who start off games negative, uh, just playing poorly. Um, and that's just kind of how it is. Um, there's not really much you can do about it. You can, you know, try to play around, you know, your stronger teammates, right? That's one. That's what I'm doing. I'm playing around this trundle, right? Or you can try to give kills to your your bot lane. That's two and five, and hope for the best. Um, <laughs> yeah. So here, I, I talked about it last video. I waste a lot of time. Um, and I realized that, like I realized that as I'm doing it, I'm like, hmm, maybe I really shouldn't be, you know, standing around like this. Um, cause like, I just went mid, right? You guys just saw that I went mid and I just walked around. I didn't get a kill. I didn't get XP. I didn't get gold. I kind of just didn't do anything. And that was just kind of a waste of time. And I don't know what I was expecting cause they, he, they weren't going to gank the Trinomir. Or it was unlikely, right? So I was like, hmm, what are you doing? You know, what are what are you really doing? What does it mean that that you're you're mid lane and there's nothing for you to do? Because the first hope was like, oh yeah, I'll just predator in, you know, right? But no, I just didn't do anything. So I wasted a good like 30 seconds to a minute walking down to mid, walking around, and then walking back up. Where I could have just stayed at the top and maybe gotten an extra few waves of CS. A little bit of extra gold, which is very, very useful. Right? And instead, I just kind of trolled it. Yeah, I don't know. It's kind of an interesting thought, because I'm not... I'm not like a... I don't know. I think I'm a smart player. But I do think I make some really stupid mistakes sometimes and that was definitely one of them like there I went for the Valkaz because bloodlust I got the bloodlust we give a kill to Vayne right I, I will gladly sacrifice myself to get someone back into the game and then have them carry um, but it's still very quite bad given that I was I'm like big because of Trundle and I should be playing around Trundle rather than hoping for Vayne to maybe do better than uh, be 1 in 3. Or I guess 0 3? No. She was 0 2. And then she got a kill for the, the Velkasha. Uh, yeah, anyways. Um, mm, you know. Yeah, it's it's pretty important to uh, figure out who the, who the actual carries are on your team, I think. I think that's a, that's a good thing to uh, learn. Oh, I want to talk about this. Uh, I want to, want to. Right. So I first tank and then I swap out. That means either Nasus has to chase me to kill me, or he has to swap to Trundle, which he does. Um, Nasus obviously just doesn't win there. But if I do just stand on Nasus, I'm pretty sure I die because he has Divine Sunderer and a lot of CDR. So I we basically like kind of juggle his aggro. At least I do. I juggle his aggro by walking in and out and hoping to bait him to walk to me while Trundle gets free auto attacks on him. And uh, yeah, we can't underestimate Nasus because Nasus still hurts and he's stacking and he has more CS than me and I basically stop CSing after like 15 minutes every game. After 15 minutes I, I stop CSing. I'm not even joking. Like that's like every every game. Flash comes out. Here I walk into the stun. I wasn't expecting it. I just flash immediately. I was like, ooh, Velkaz is gonna full combo me or something. I didn't know he didn't have ult, but I was still expecting it. It was scary. Here, we bully Nasus again. <laughs>
And this takes a while, so we get them eventually, but good lord, that takes a while. Um, yeah, eight deaths, 19 minutes in. Dying every two and a half minutes, every two and 30, I don't, I don't know. Yeah, we're bullying him, and he's still typing. At this point, he's still typing. He's like, I'm still going to win. I don't know why you guys are ganking me. Like, stuff like that. And it's like, bro, you were basically a free kill. You know, we didn't really need to try very hard to get you. Um, we go for TP, and this is kind of not great. Like, we get, we get the... Get the MF... The shutdown on MF, we lose the dragon, and we just need to run because, like, their AoE is kind of wild. Yeah, that's that, that was kind of it. We're down on drags, sadly. It's, it sucks, but yeah. Here I'm uh, matching Nasus. I, I realize that sometimes. A lot of times I just don't bother matching, which is really bad if like a Yorick or something is like split pushing and I'm just not there. And that's kind of trolling. So I know I can't fight Nasus here, it's just not not something feasible. Um, I don't win. Um, I can tank him, but it's I, I need someone else to help help me uh, deal with him. I think Trindamir comes down here at some point. Am I right? Oh, movement. Nice. Three kills. Then you gotta stop this stop this Nasus. Look how long it's gonna look at this. This is awful. Look how big Nasus is. Can't do anything to him. <laughs> what do you do? But yeah, um you can proxy a Nasus's wave just to kinda like stop him from doing stuff. Like cause he needs a wave to push. So if you just clear the wave, that's like whatever. think about it. <laughs> we just have to like delay like crazy for, for Vayne to do stuff. But yeah, uh, me giving gold to Vayne is actually doing fairly well. Um, she has six kills now. She went from 0 2 to 6 3 and um, let me check gold was X. She has the most gold on the team. I gave her a lot of gold. I gave her two or three shutdowns. Right? That's me. I did that. Um, and she's doing better than MF. Then when she matches farm, then it's like even better. You know? I don't know. I don't, uh, I'm just I'm just rambling. I'm here to ramble. You know, what? I might as well give an update on like life stuff. Um, hmm. I'm moving to LA in probably December. Um, I've been in Utah for two years, and there's just like. I don't know, I have very clear, like, I know what I want and I know what I don't want. And being in Utah is definitely a don't want. So... <laughs> I, I needed, I really needed to just change my situation, because it was just not good. Here I should have won in. I did not realize that Trundle would live so long, and if, if I walked in, maybe he would have gotten a reset. Off, uh, off of Triumph slash uh, his passive plus score Drinker. And maybe we could have wiped them back, but I was playing like really, really greedy and safe. Um, I've been focusing on limiting my deaths rather than playing for the team sometimes. So that 
tends to like being a kda player is fine but you tend to just not make any plays ever and that's also not a good thing so yeah but yeah i'm, I'm moving to la um i'm gonna do some like trash job for a year and then when i get my california citizenship i'm going to do uh become a pub notary public and because i have uh like family connection family friend connections with like a, a notary agency i can just do that for the rest of my life while i do other stuff because it's like a pretty straightforward and like just like easy job of like oh yeah witness papers and sign them or like stamp them like, oh, this person's signing a lease. Make sure that they're not being held at gunpoint. Uh, signing the thing, you know, stuff like that. Um, and that pays pretty well. A couple K a month, which is livable. And then you can... Yeah, it's, it's like based on your own time as well. So it's like, you know, why not? Right. Free pickup on Velkaz. I loop back because I don't want Lulu to get one shot. I don't know, I think... Uh, I think I'm pretty good at the league now. I definitely, definitely can be doing better. Like, reacting more. Stuff like that. But, I think I'm doing pretty well. Like, this game I did pretty well. You know, this Nasus is tilted. I have 15 assists, which is more than Lulu. I have a lot of participation. I have 19 out of 23 participation, which is incredibly high. Um, which is usually not something that happens when you are a uh, top lane. But this is how, how you play the video game, right? Your Nasus just kind of gets kited. Lol, Lamau, Lamau. Um. I don't know. Stuff. Stuff. I'm stuff. Aha, Jonathan, you are, uh, you know. Absolutely ruining this echo. Um, and I can't really do a whole lot. Like, Vayne is just popping off. I, I just, you know. And I really thought Vayne was going to come back, but she just kept pushing. So I was like, mm. So I flash eat echo, thinking that Vayne would... Uh, go kill him, like two shot him, because you know he's fed. Uh, but she kind of kept going and then died to MF, which is fine. You know, could could have been better, but like it was like oh, okay, expected uh, a different result. Uh, definitely should be communicating more with pings. Yeah, I don't know. Um. Yeah, mental health check. Go, go get yourself checked. Um, take care of yourselves. I, I think that's really important because I was in a really bad place for a long time and like I just needed to change things. So I'm moving to LA because I feel stagnant in Utah. No, no offense. Okay, people who live in Utah is just not not for me it's definitely for someone that appreciates it much much more and i'm not someone who likes to go outside so i don't appreciate the outdoors and hiking and walking and stuff as much as other people okay i'm sorry about that but that's just kind of how it is This is really scuffed. This is a scuffed fight. <laughs> and then Trinomir goes in. I don't know. We have a gore drinker Trinomir that... Yeah, I I mean, we called it. We were like, mm, this Trinomir is not going to do very much. And he didn't. I don't know. Is gore drinker the play there? Do you really gore, gore, gore drinker into this team? I feel like it's so... I don't know, it seems particularly useless. Maybe that's just me. You know, maybe I just don't understand the game. I don't understand why you would go Gore Drinker this game. 
Because your problem isn't like sustain because you have your ult. Your problem is actually like killing anyone. And if you can't kill anyone, then like what's the point? I think he just doesn't do anything this game, if I remember correctly. But yeah, I'm definitely taking credit for the vein being big though. Seriously, that's that was me. I did that. Here's a big TP flank. Look at this. Let's go, let's go. And I just run at MF. Because I know she's not going to do anything. Right? It's just free, you know? Free game. Easy. Free ace. <laughs> and this Nasus, he's 211. He's died every three minutes now. That's the that's the average. Yeah, what a weird guy. What a weird guy indeed. Get the inhib. Yeah, Nasus is an uh, interesting time, I'll say. A mobile Pikmin game where you walk around or something. Why do they keep doing uh, alter alternative reality games? What's what's that about? Hmm? I want to know. I think Trundle gets caught out here. If I remember correctly, Trundle gets caught here by three. Yeah. It was unfortunate. He was kind of pissed about that. Because I was just like, ugh. I don't know. This Nasus is a rage splitting. Because he knows he can't do anything. It's so funny. Look at me, I'm just running down the MF. <laughs> MF dies, Vayne is doing things. I don't know about our Trinomir, Trinomir is not a real player, I don't think. It's very strange. I do have TP. Um, I think I make a bad TP play. Maybe I don't. Maybe that was a different game. I played so many games in the last few days that I'm like, I've lost. I've lost it, you know? Yeah, Baron gets stolen. I'm lucky. Come back. I need to deal with this Nasus. There goes Susan. Directly shove it down mid. But yeah, this is a, a singed game where I have 20 something assists, which is crazy. Playing for team. I don't know, like... Flashing for the Lulu support is a, is a strange idea. Oh yeah, look at this, look at this Nas is coming in. Like, where is he going? Why did he run past Vayne? <laughs> I 
What was that? Not much I can do there for uh, for the vein. Like if I walk back in, I just sort of sink and die. And then Trundle dies again. Uh, but yeah. Um, what's it called? I don't know. This this, this is like a normal game, dude. Normal. This is a, a diamond game. With uh, 70 kills. It's like what? I know. I'm not. I'm not like high, high elo yet. Okay, it'll, it'll be a while until maybe I get masters. I need. Let's see. I need 60 LP plus promos. Four. Four plus like three. I need seven wins in a row for masters. Which would be cool, but in my humble opinion, I don't think I am good enough for that. If I get carried, cool, um, but I personally don't think, uh, skill-wise, I'm, I'm at that point yet. We'll see that. We'll see when we get there. You would do a little bit of running around, not too much of a... Die, but everyone else is alive, so game. Apparently, Vayne was grandmasters at some point. I guess that's last season. Yeah. Anyways, wait. I wanna. I wanna look at that. Uh, Nasus. Five three twenty seven. By the way, let's look at his Nasus. They don't play Nasus, right? Yeah. They're auto filled jungle with six hundred games. They are. uh Okay, well, no match history. Sorry, yeah. Um, yeah, we'll title this video something something about like tilting your team, uh, tilting the enemy team, or purposely, you know. The league is all mental. Skill doesn't matter. Sort of something like that. Um, damn, I'm really I'm feeling really tired right now. So thank thank you for watching. Much love. Subscribe, like, uh, maybe leave it up one of my playlists on auto repeat. Or autoplay, you know, you know, you wanna if you wanna, you know, help the help the boy out. <laughs> but yeah, I'm I'm gonna peace out. Thank you for watching. Much love. Yeah.